For his food, I use the farmer's dog, and it's super nice. I really like it, so I, I just keep it in my fridge. Are you ready to eat some breakfast? Yes. Woo! Yes, you're so excited. Okay, ready? Go get it. Go get it. Oh, good job. Good boy. Hey guys, good morning. Welcome back to Kennedy K. I'm Kennedy and this is my little puppy, Kobe Bear. Say hi, Kobe Bear. Hi. I am going to show you guys today what it's like in the morning of having Kobe Bear and kind of my life and my husband going to school and everything else. So I just woke up, Kobe Bear is waking up too. And so um, I'll kind of tell you guys his schedule of like what this video is gonna be today is kind of like I'm telling you what his schedule is and kind of what I do throughout my morning and kind of my goals for January, 2022. And yeah, are you excited? Yeah. Before we get going, make sure that you subscribe down below and hit the notification bell and follow me on my social media and give this video a big thumbs up. All right, that was a lot to do, but if you do it, it'll really help out. All right, okay, so next, what we just did is Kobe Bear. So I've just been trying him sleeping in our bedroom lately because he's been waking up really early and just cries. And then like I'll take him out to go potty and then he will like still end up crying like every hour after like he wakes up around like six usually. So I would try yesterday of him sleeping in our room and he like slept way better. And so uh, this last night he um, slept in our room the whole night and he only went to the bathroom early in the morning and then I put him back in his kennel and he like hasn't cried at all. I literally just woke him up when I woke up. So it's actually been pretty good. So I think we're going to continue to do that for right now. But if you guys have tips for like different things with your puppies and things, please comment down below because I am definitely a new timer. And so it's, this is kind of what I found, but I would love for you to hear more like help with um, sleeping and with like chewing and things like that. So definitely help me out. So usually what I do after Kobe Bear has woken up and I've woken up is I bring him potty again. So we're going to bring him potty. You ready to go potty? You go potty? Yeah. So we're trying to do the bells, so I'm teaching him to the bells, but we have sometimes an accident because he will kind of get confused where he will pee on the floor and then he'll ring the bells. I'm like, no, go be fair, but he's learning the bells. We're just, we're trying to figure it out in total, huh? Huh. So this is what I do. I get him and we ring the bells, ring the bells. Good boy. And then I just let him out potty for a second. So he's gonna go potty and then I usually um, try to clean up things around the house if there's anything on the floor so that when he comes back, he like, doesn't have anything to chew on except for his toys. Then I start getting all of his food ready. So let's do that. All right guys, so I've been checking around the floor. There's nothing he can chew on. So it's time now for food and water. So I usually just fill up his water a little bit more. Oh, and I hear Kobe Bear. So let's let's go get him. Kobe Bear! Hi Kobe Bear! He's ready to come inside. <gasps> Good boy! You went potty! Good boy! I'm so proud! I'm so proud! Good job! Ignore my baby voice, but he's I always congratulate him when he does potty outside because I heard that's like the best thing to do. <laughs> Good job! Okay, you hungry? Do you want some food? Yeah? Okay, let's get you some food. For his food, I use the farmer's dog, and it's super nice, I really like it, so I, I just keep it in my fridge. So it's right here, and so I'll grab it out of the fridge, and I just feed him um, breakfast through uh, farmer's dog. This is kind of what I put it in. It's fresh food that is basically just kind of like all cut up in pieces. I have right now the chicken, there's broccoli, there's carrots. You can actually tell it's super fresh. Like you can tell what's actually in there. I saw this and I saw that they um, do food that's like super fresh and so I was looking into it and I didn't really want to get my dogs like those little burnt circle things. I thought maybe it would be kind of nice to like get them fresh things so I can see what they're eating and making sure that my puppy is getting the nutrients that he needs. And so I saw this and so I've been getting this and I've been loving it. So what it does is they send you, they deliver it to your house, they deliver it in a box, they send you all the different foods that you ordered and you can put the rest of them in the freezer if you'd like until the, your puppy's gonna use it. So I can show you I have a bunch in my freezer of different types. It's right here. We have one that is chicken recipe and it tells you how much the puppy needs. So it's like one fourth of this per day. So I just give them a little bit of each that and so it helps them to not feed them too much. And it's also just like super nice to like um, just have my freezer easy done. It's still fresh. But yeah, it even tells you the day that it was made. Super nice. So I keep those in my freezer and then I take one out to unfreeze it and then I put it in 
this little bin, and then I feed it to Kobe. So, he's super excited. Are you ready to eat some breakfast? Yes? Woo! Yes, he's so excited. Let's get some breakfast. Let's, let's get some breakfast. All right, let's go. So I just smashed it all up, and look how just like fresh and like yummy it looks for your puppy. I think it is just perfect for Kobe Bear. And now I'm gonna get to like, you can actually, before I do, like look, you can see the actual like broccoli pieces and carrots in there so you can know exactly what your puppy is eating, which is so nice. And I just love how it delivers to your door. You don't have to stress about it. Going to the grocery store, I love it. It's definitely worth knowing what my puppy eats. Plus, he loves it, so it's nice because he'll eat his food. I know it's healthy, I know it's good for him. So I really, really like the farmer's dog um, food options. <laughs> Oh, he's excited for food. Let's get him some food. <laughs> All right, Bear, are you ready? You ready to do food? Okay, here's some food. All right, so I'm getting him fed. He has some water in there. And then for the rest of the day, I'm just kind of gonna clean up, get ready, work out. I'm gonna show you guys all of that and kind of how I deal with the puppy as well during that time. Oh, he is chowing down on that food. Mmm, he loves it. All right, guys, so if you're interested in getting some of this dog food for your dog, go to thefarmersdog.com slash KennedyK, and I'll put it right here. Also, I have a discount where you can get 50% off for your next purchase. So definitely go check them out. I'll give you the code right here, everything, and it also is in the link down below. So go check out The Farmer's Dog. Oh, and I also forgot to tell you guys that Chase is still sleeping right now. He stayed up super late studying, so that's where he is if you guys have any questions about that. But we'll see him later on for sure. So now that Kobe's eating, I'm gonna start cleaning up around the house. It's a little messy. There's like a few little things everywhere. So I'm gonna clean up and make the bed, do laundry, get all that stuff started, and probably start reading my scriptures. And yeah, so we'll just kind of show you guys throughout the day what I'm doing. All right guys, Bear's done eating. Are you happy in your heart? Yes, you're happy. Okay, now basically I'm just gonna kind of clean and I set a timer so I know that I need to bring him out potty again in the next few minutes because once he's done eating, then it is time to go potty. So I'm gonna start kind of cleaning up. He's just gonna hang out for a second and then we'll bring him potty again. You were tall, I looked up From where I sat, wished I wouldn't dress up all right guys, so I just finished the oh, dishwasher. But Bear brought me his ball. You want to see play? Huh? Okay, baby, go get it. Go get it. Oh, good job. Good boy. He doesn't understand yet that if you have you have to give me the ball so I can throw it. He wants to just like play. Let's <laughs> juggle it. Okay, ready? You ready? Oh, oh, be careful. Go get it. Good boy, good boy. Okay, he's ready, but he, he doesn't know how to play catch yet. We're learning. All right guys, so I just brought Kobe potty again, just because after they eat, they usually have to pee or they have to go to the bathroom. Um, like 10, 15 minutes after is what I've heard. So I usually bring him out potty again around that time. So he just went to the bathroom. Good boy, good boy. Did you just go potty? Good boy, there we go. Good boy, good job. He's such a good boy, yes. He's a good, good boy, huh? Good job. All right guys, so Chase just woke up. He's getting ready for school. And so we're gonna make some breakfast, huh? He already ate breakfast, but, and then we're just gonna bring him to school and finish the rest of our day. All right, so I just asked Chase what he wanted for breakfast, and he wants our leftover spaghetti from uh, last night. So he is crazy, but I'm gonna make him our leftover spaghetti easy. All right, we have his spaghetti, and I'm probably gonna have a yogurt. All right guys, so we just ate breakfast, and now it is time for Chase to finish getting ready for school, and I'm gonna read my scriptures, and then I'm gonna bring him to school. So, let's go do it. Kobe, are you ready to read the scriptures? Yeah? Okay, let's do it. Let's read our scriptures. This is not working out the way. <laughs> He's eating my camera. Nugget, nugget.
guys, halfway through my scripture study, Kobe looked at me and rang the bell. And so he's going potty right now. So that's great for learning. Hi, Bear. Do you want to come in? Good boy. You did so good. You went potty. Good job. I'm so proud. Good job. Yeah. Alright guys, I'm done with scripture study and Chase, he's right here. Say hello Chase. Hello. See, he's getting all of his stuff. Packer school. I'm gonna go put on some shoes and a coat. And there's Kobe Bear. Hi Kobe! Hello! You ready to go? Okay. Alright guys, I got the bear. I got the shoes. We have the husband. This is great. I'm wondering, I'm wondering. Alright guys, Chase is leaving for school. Love you. Love you. Okay, bye guys. There he is. Love him. Now Kobe Bear and I are going to go home. Okay. You ready to go? Okay. We're gonna go home. All right guys, so we are home now, and so we are going to just kind of finish cleaning up a little bit. I'm gonna go make the bed, get new sheets on there, everything, get all cleaned, do some laundry, work out. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be a long morning. Let's go. So the kitchen is done, hi. And so now we're ah. gonna go into my bedroom and clean that. Come on, should we show that? The office is already all clean. Now we just have to do bedroom. Come on, let's go. All right, so the bedroom is a huge mess. So we are gonna have to clean this baby up. I always start by opening the blinds and the drapes and getting this to be brighter and happier. Bear keeps biting on random like socks and things, so we're gonna probably have to put him in his little bed for a sec. a bunch of laundry in the washer and in the dryer and I'm gonna fold these clothes and then we'll continue from there. All right guys, so now we are done cleaning. Hello Bear. Hello. And now it's time for me to go work out. Bear, how are you doing? Don't even hurt. Don't eat my hair. Bear. Ah. Hello. Mm. All right, we'll go work out. All right, guys, so now it's time to work out. I'm in my all black. And I'm gonna put Bear in his kennel because it's really hard to work out with um, him just wandering. And I can't keep an eye on him and make sure he's not going to the bathroom or anything like that. So I'm gonna put him in his kennel and then I'm gonna work out and then I'll get ready for the day. And yeah, let's do it. Alright guys, so now I'm done with my workout and now it's time to go to just get ready for the day. Kobe Bear! Hello, Bear! Hello! Sit! Good boy! Good boy! Hello! Come on, let's go potty! Come on! Let's go potty! He just went potty! Good boy! He's so proud! Good job! Alright, let's get some lunch! Bear, you ready to get ready for the day? All right, let's get ready, come on. Well guys, so I got out of the shower and I accidentally cut my nose a little bit, like scratched it. Long story, but I scratched my nose and now I'm bleeding. I know Kobe Bear, it's so sad. All right, well I'm gonna get dressed and hopefully my nose will stop. I already put some tissues on it to make it stop bleeding, so hopefully it will get better. So you don't 
All right, so I probably should tell you guys why and how I cut my nose. It's kind of embarrassing, but I got sunburn on my cheeks the other day, and I noticed that I was kind of peeling in the shower, so I was like kind of scratching my nose. Brian's not happy. Anyway, I was scratching my nose, and then I actually scratched it actually really hard, and then it started bleeding. I was like, oh gosh. So it's my fault. I shouldn't have done that, but we'll see if that heals. Good. I don't think I can put makeup on now. That's okay. We don't need makeup. I'm just gonna blow dry my hair and then call it good. All right guys, so my hair is basically dry. Um, there's just a little bit left, like a little damp. And so, oh, hi there. Now I'm going to uh, separate into pieces. I'll cut my sections. He's not like that, I'm blow dry my hair. I'm gonna separate into sections and then use this blow dry brush to just make it nice and soft and pretty. Yeah. I don't even know what I want no more, no more, no more, yeah. I'ma figure out what to do with all my time. Well guys, my nose is still bleeding, so it looks like I'm not wearing makeup, but I am done with my hair. I'm just going to see if I can get my nose to stop bleeding and hang out with Kobe Bear for the rest of the day. We'll probably go do some errands or things. Let me grab Bear. All right, Mr. Bear. Bye. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Make sure that you subscribe down below and hit that notification bell and follow me on all my social media and give this video a big thumbs up. Kiki, say bye.